Hey girls, it's today for you. I have a What's in My Travel Makeup Bag. I do do these videos about two times a year when I go on my big major trips. Um, this weekend I'm not going on a big major trip. I'm just going away for the long weekend that we're having in Canada. Just give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see how I get ready for like a road trip or something. And I'll definitely get to filming that because I think that would be really fun to film. So, um, without this long intro, I'm just going to jump into showing you girls what I have in my travel makeup bag. This makeup bag is from Aeropostale. I mentioned it in my last makeup bag video, which wasn't too long ago actually, but um, it just says think happy, be happy, and it's just really cute, and I love how it's clear so I can see everything that's in here. So um, I'm not going to be showing you the brushes, but I'm going to be showing you the makeup products that I'm bringing. So the first thing I'm going to be bringing for this trip is my... NYX Natural Eye Eyeshadow Palette. It just has a bunch of natural shades and I think it's really perfect for doing just an everyday neutral eye. Next I have one of my two lip products and this is just the e.l.f. Jumbo Lip Gloss Stick or Jumbo Lip Pencil in the shade in the nude and it's just a really pretty nude color because it's just very natural and very wearable. Next I have this Model Co. Light Up Lip Lights in the shade Coral. It's just a really pretty coral color and I think it's really beautiful to wear over top of the nude lipstick. Then I have my Rimmel Stay Matte Powder which is almost gone if you can't tell and I love this powder because it really sets my makeup and it keeps my face matte pretty much all day and I love how inexpensive it is. Then I have my first mascara which is just my Ulta Voluptuous Volume Mascara and it's just a regular lengthening and defining and separating mascara which I love and I love how it's from the drugstore and this is comparable to the Benefit um, the Benefit not their real Benefit La it's the one with the black tube you know. the mascara I have is my Trina Tarantino mascara it is just a huge brush like that other Benefit Mascara it just looks like this, and I really like this because it's a really great mascara to pair underneath with the Ulta mascara. Then I have this primer which I haven't used in a long time, and this is my number seven beautifully matte makeup base. And I just am in love with this. It keeps my face perfectly matte all day, and it really keeps my makeup in place, and it really just covers up all my pores and creates a very nice barrier between. Um, like my skin and the foundation so it just goes on perfectly and makes my foundation look like picture perfect so I've been trying out a lot of foundations lately and I finally found one that I think is gonna be perfect for summer if I don't get a tan which I probably will but I love this uh, Sephora instant radiance foundation it comes with a pump so it's really handy and I find that this gives me the best like the best application for this is applying this on a beauty blender and then dotting it all over my face and blending it in and I just love this foundation so much. Since I'm going to be waking up pretty early every day to go shopping, I need a concealer that will hide my under eye circles and this is just the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Brightening Under Eye Concealer and it just has the little sponge applicator. This is my second purchase of this concealer and I'm absolutely in love with it. Next I have another concealer and this is just my e.l.f. Tone Correcting Concealer. I don't really like this that much but I just really want to use it up and I feel like after this weekend I'll be good. Then I just have my e.l.f. Clear Brow Gel and this one's almost done so I have to repurchase a new one when I go shopping in the US of A this weekend. Then I just have my NYX Jet Black Eyeliner and I love this. This is drying out but I'm trying to use up as much as I can before it does dry out. And it just gives me the perfect matte black line and it doesn't smudge and it stays all day. I have my Urban Decay Primer Potion and bear with me. This will be the one year anniversary that I've been using this tiny tube of Urban Decay Primer Potion. I bought this on May Long of 2013 and it's still, it's still going but it's almost done, which is great because I have to throw it out soon because I feel like it's not like as good as it used to be because it's old, but yeah, i got to pack my primer potion. Then lastly, in my bag, I just have my Essence Brow Powder Set. Um, nothing special. It's kind of dirty because I pretty much use it every day besides today, which is kind of ironic because I say I use it every day, but I don't have my brows done today. 
But I love this set to fill my eyebrows. It comes with two shades, and I think they match my eyebrows perfectly, especially because I love to do super dark eyebrows. Uh, yeah, that's just everything I have decided to pack. So give this video a big thumbs up. Again, if you want to see a get ready with me for a road trip video, and I'll definitely get that up because, again, that'll be really fun to film. So uh, thanks for watching, girls. Just comment down below any suggestions you may have, and I'd really appreciate it. And just subscribe and check out my channel and check out my other videos. And thank you so much for 460 subscribers. You girls or boys are freaking fabulous. And I love you. So, yeah. Love ya.